the type of person that's tasted their own cum. Oh, yeah, 100%. <laughs> He was mad at me that I hadn't tried it. But you see, not everyone does this. I didn't say that about you. (laughs) Thank you. We're in. Hey. We're about to say nothing. Kim Alcova, back round two. Round two. How do you feel? I feel great. Different place, still in the valley. Isn't that life, though? I feel like I've been here before. Uh, Oh, in what capacity, madam? (laughs) I don't know. I feel like an old agent used to have, like... um, Oh, an old agent. Yeah. Did he have a couch? Yes. With the TV and a microphone and a recording? No. I know where you guys are going. I don't know what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? I was talking about casting couch. Yeah. Yeah. Me too. For Disney. Yep, Disney Plus. Mm. Is that a real thing? Do people subscribe to Disney Plus? I do. Do you? Yeah. Really? What's your what? But I rarely use it. Like, probably rarely? twice a year. <laughs> what? For what? Do you like a Star Wars lady? I just like having options. <sighs> I literally have every every streaming I think, platform that can I, I can have. Because I watch so much but TV, I so I run out of options Sometimes a lot. I look at my desk and I have like a matcha, a coffee, a water, and a lemonade. I'm like, I want options. Yeah. <laughs> I want options. And that's also like the downfall, because really it takes me downfall. two hours to be yeah. able to yeah. choose what I want to watch. And then I'll even start watching it. I'll be like, no. <laughs> I always <laughs> eat all it. my food before I find what I want. Me too. I think that the, we're doing it wrong. We got to reverse engineer it. We got to pick what we want, then make our food, then come back. How come nobody does that? I have a time limit. What do you mean? I swear to God, I go and I go, Michael, you have 20 <laughs> seconds. I swear to God. And You're I'm really like, just an insane no. person. I just choose. I'm sick of it because to your point, I will finish my chicken teriyaki. Then I'm watching yeah. some bullshit I don't even like. Well, I'm watching, watching Donnie like a- Brasco. I don't want to fucking watch Donnie Brasco. I've seen his 48 times. He's so hot in that film. But... You know what I mean? I just, I pick one. 20 seconds? Well, I 20. feel like especially if you're going into like a TV show, it's it's a long investment and it could have Correct. multiple seasons. Like it's it's a big decision. When I go to a new TV thing and it's been out for a while and it has like over three seasons, I'm out. You're out. Too many things to think. Because I want to finish it. I'm a big like, if I start a book, I finish it. If I'm a, well, that's a lie. There's one book I haven't finished, Sex at Dawn. I've been talking about it for two years, haven't finished it. Oh, I've heard but of that. It's so good. Monogamy's stupid. We're <laughs> bonobos. <laughs> I've heard it? all of this. What is that? that My means... ex-boyfriend used to quote that fucking book uh, all the time. Once yeah. we start reading, it's a wrap. Yeah. Were, weren't or were? Huh? You were in an open relationship? Were. How does that work and tell every woman in the world? I don't think it works. <laughs> oh, no. Delete it. Uh, <laughs> delete it. Don't worry because it works it. too good. Yep. Thank you. Well, I think, okay. It <laughs> but can, it's like Netflix, mm. Hulu. You got to have your options. I'm not comparing women to streaming platforms. Yes, you are. But if they were, they would be I want to fuck Plus. HBO Max. This is not good. So, open relationship. Did he... So, he obviously pitched it. Yeah. Okay. But at the at the time, I had gotten out of a relationship, and I don't know, maybe I was greedy because I was with another adult star, so I was, like, having sex with people all the time on camera. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah, like, yeah. I wanted but to have sex with them sharp. off camera. You're just practicing. You're just shooting hoops. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, yeah. It was, like, a yeah, performative thing where I really wanted to connect. I'd, like, kind of leave and have crushes, and I'd be like, damn it, why am I married? <laughs> oh, no, you... Oh, so you, I, I, you, yeah. Go ahead, so sorry. going into the second relationship, I was all for the idea, and I do think that it can work for people like for a time and yeah. at that time in their lives. Mm. But ultimately, what I've noticed is people in open relationships like they try it out, and usually it, they either close it back up after a little while. Yeah. Or they separate. Well, I think a lot of it is like the dude's not getting any action, and he's like, "What the fuck? You're out here in these streets. I'm at home." And maybe he's jealous. I think usually it's like really hypersexual people that choose to be in open relationships, oh. right? Like, so they're, they are just all I having sex. I think it should be open relationships to save our current relationship. Uh-oh. Or open relationships with other open relationships. No, but for Wait, what? No, 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 You bring penis, I bring penis. And you know, you're all meeting up for if you fuck, if you, if you fuck with another couple. Yeah, if you fuck your uh-huh. boyfriend yeah. in the same room as somebody else, it yeah. still feels a bit open and exciting, but you're still not sort of cheating yeah. because you can have like the visual of the Andrew, other couple Dave fucking. And Busters. Well, you're never, you're never cheating if you have, if like you're fully transparent and they're on board. I love it. That sounds like a quote from that book. <laughs> no, no, that's just how I think. Uh, <laughs> yeah. it's I, not really I think you reading. can definitely cheat in an open relationship. Oh, it's yeah. It's things that you 100%. do behind their back. Yeah, you go to 24 yeah. Hour Fitness and you you like fuck someone in the steam room or and you don't like tell her. Or like you violate a boundary that you guys had together. Like maybe like you don't talk about this specific subject or you don't perform this sex act. Yeah, and you yeah. do Can't that put anyway a and you don't your ass tell or something them. Like that. Yes. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. The first guy that said, but rules are meant to be broken. It's kind of a banger right there. It is a banger. But rules are meant to be broken. It's just human nature. Yes, yeah. bonobos, dude. Yeah. 
So we're all supposed to get married for like three years and then move on. Yes. How does this work? Like a no. No, nope. I don't right. think so. Lifetime? Can I can I can I pitch this thing that I've already pitched on the show before, but I want to get your take on this. Yeah. My pitch, and this is, I guess, technically open relationship. You can cheat on your partner once a quarter, but everything's open, transparent, open. Cheating. But but I will say it's not like a it's not like rollover minutes. You can't like have like three at the end of the year. Uh, and and what I'm saying is I don't think that a lot of people would would take the option, but the option makes the relationship more exciting because if you go out with your girls, you go to Vegas, you still have the option, so it makes it still fun, but but you don't have to take the option. I think that- It's a trap. One, it's 100%. Yeah, you don't have to take the option, babe, but you know your waitress is staring you down. Yeah, what do you classify as cheating? Oh, I <laughs> zoom I, in. I, I, I literally classify Even cheating. The thought of it is cheating. Exactly, exactly. Other what, women, whoa. why? No, well, you're kidding, you're kidding. He's, I, he, well, let's let's do it. Let's. I think this is a great question. Well, what, okay. what, what, what yeah, what, what, we, what we classify cheating? I classify cheating as if it were in a closed relationship, mm -hmm. and you make a physical or an emotional connection Ooh. with okay. somebody. And emotional cheating is Somebody's real. Been what is what is emotional cheating? Like you're you're sitting there telling like this person Instagram I love story. you, and you're like wanting well, to be crazy. with them instead. Well, I don't insane. know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah like that's insane. Uh, I don't know what emotional cheating is. Emotion Go ahead. No, I was just gonna say, like, if you're like responding to like a very famous woman, you're like, I love you so much. It, it's like not real. But if you're like responding to like a coworker, like, I love you so much, it's Correct. like very much cheating, which yeah, is so yeah, funny. Yeah, that is cheating. I That's my Taylor Swift. What? I, <laughs> I, think, HR. I think if you if you make a strong emotional connection with someone like at work or whatever, and you like go and you can like, oh, this is you you bring up this a lot, where it's like, oh, this is my work husband, blah blah blah. It's like oh, there's okay. something there's something like you're, about, you're flirty. There's something between the two yeah. of you. You're like you're, you're too like, curious deep. You're, you're like, like, yeah, you're too curious. Like if you guys, if you and your partner separated, that's the first person you're jumping. A on. lily pad yeah. is what I'm talking yeah. about. If you set up, that's why work from home is good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nobody cheated. Social media. Work yeah, from, true. Work, Instagram DMs. work from home yes. helped your business out like a motherfucker. Do you it think? Did. I remember oh, the beginning yeah. of the pandemic. I went to Sammy's cameras in Fairfax, and there was a girl with a gray hoodie over her head, and she goes, "Do you guys have any more ring lights?" And uh, GoPros, and the guy was like, "We're all out of everything." Holy shit! Yeah, I think she was going home to film parts of her body. Yeah, doing what? Canals, backflips. Could have been doing TikToks too. Oh, I don't no, think no, so. No, 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 no. I don't no, think this so. Was she was not smoking a, this menthols was not inside. A, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got okay. GoPros. Okay. Her boobs said different. She definitely could have been. She definitely <laughs> could have been. But like the hood. Well, that is true. Being what's more, you know, she put the hood on. She's like, I don't want to be known as a tech talker. Yeah, I don't know. I have a question. So the whole the what's it called with the work work wife work husband where you get turned on by somebody does that happen in the adult entertainment <clears throat> where you like work with somebody enough that in the beginning you didn't maybe think they're the most attractive but like over time you're like oh interesting a little turned on by Rodney. <sighs> Rodney's such um, a cool name. I, got that I think so, yes, name. but mainly it's when I would see pictures of them online. I'd uh -huh. kind of be like, mm, like I'm really, uh, I don't know. And then personality Like I'm not really it. looking forward to this. And then I'd get there and I like they'd be like, have that little twinkle in their eyes and yeah. they're flirting with you. And then like like the chemistry and everything starts to play a part. And then you're like, yeah, I get it. We'll, we'll do this again. Nice. Yeah. So have you, ever, husband. have you ever like left the scene? Well, you're, are you in a relationship now? Yes. Okay. So there was a part, so the last relationship you talked about in the current one, there, was there like a like a break in the relationship? Were you single for a little bit? No, I'm, I haven't been really single for 10 years. Like I'm, I'm a like, I just Serial keep- Serial monogamous? Yeah, I just- Serial monogamous? Yeah, I keep just like, well, I, I do, I do what, what like mean? shoot with other women, but I just keep jumping from relationship to relationship. And I only have like a month in between. It's like the, oh, it's like the one, like the, gotcha. the one person I start having sex with the second I'm single, I end up in another long-term relationship. And I'm never looking for it. I'm always, I'm, yeah, I'm just kind of like, just I do, I do need to have sex. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> like, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Find in love. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was 10 years with one guy off and on, but it's like you're dating, you get out of something, you get into something, just yeah. kind of always. That, yeah, that's how why, I am. So you're not looking for it, so why do you think that is? Um, I think I'm a hopeless romantic, I and I it. think I prefer to be in Same. relationships too. Ladies. I, I prefer to have, <laughs> Sorry. I, prefer, I, I like to have like a best friend. Cause I'm I'm Aww. also like I'm also very like uh, introverted and I keep to myself, so I don't have a lot of friends at all. Like I'm I'm a very lonely person otherwise. Animals, yeah. Dogs, of course, of course. I yes. have my little dogs. <laughs> yeah, of course. What type of dogs do you have? 
I have a loss of upso and then um What the uh, hell? Who? <laughs> <laughs> you know the dog have you ever seen pictures? Did you call me? <laughs> have, you ever, <laughs> have you ever seen pictures of the dogs with the really long hair that goes down to their feet? That's what they're called? Yeah. That it looks like, like it looks like, like a goonie. It looks like an Ottoman. Oh, that's, oh, that's an Ottoman. Oh, that's oh, it. You. Bro, that's that's a not a dog. Oh, that's you. a Roomba. They're little mops. Wait, you can literally hide another dog underneath all that hair. You little babies. Do you like do they're do actually you, psychotic? Do you do cornrows on yeah. her or anything cool? No, I don't even brush her. You don't, <laughs> don't brush her? That's too much work. Like somebody... I just get her hair cut. Oh, she, okay. I give her the teddy bear cut. How did she see? Like they're all in ACDC. She has the she has the teddy bear cut. So like once a month she like uh they clean up around her eyes and stuff. You gel it? Oh you dude, do... I went to a I, some I have a cat and he <laughs> cat guy. But I went to get his nails trimmed at a place and there was a guy with a really high end dog and they misgendered the dog and it was a scene. Oh, he no. goes, uh, is, is he not? He goes, he, well, she is ready, and, sh and her name is Storm. And I was like, and you're a loser. 100%. <laughs> I mean, what, dude. Storm? I, dude, for, for, yeah, the first, capital? <laughs> on January 6th. He was there. He wasn't there. He was there. No, I'm sweating. But I'm yeah, sick of I it. just like, come on, man. This guy's getting paid minimum wage to clip dogs all day. And you're over here being like, um, well, actually, it's a dog. It's people, a literal dog. Do people get sad when they misgender my dog? And I don't care at all. And I'm like, oh, they go, oh, he's. And I go, oh, and then I go, oh, it's you correct. Wait, it sounds no, like no, they no, get no. insulted. No, no, right? yeah. I do actually. I don't. No, no, I don't correct. I and they ask me what her name is. I go, Greta. And they go, oh my god, it's a girl. And they get, they get. I'm like, oh, I don't care at all. Yeah, but they yeah. get, they get sad that they did it. I'm like, first of all, my dog looks <laughs> like a dude. It has a chain <laughs> collar. You know what yeah. I mean? It's like, it looks, she looks like a dude. Yeah, rolls her own cigarettes. That's I, what I'm saying. I have another dog, and I have a friend who's known this dog for two years, <laughs> and her name is Elfie, and she's the most beautiful little, like, feminine thing you've ever seen. And I'm on the phone with him one day, and he's like, and I said, she. He's like, Alfie's a girl? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I guess he thought the name was, like, Alfie. Is, is when it's like Alfie Alfie's for Alphaba. Oh, it's like. Oh, I thought it was Elf bars, like the vapes. I thought it was Elsa, <laughs> frozen. Uh, I'm gonna be in Oklahoma. <laughs> no, but uh, I, is your friend a guy? Yeah. Guys can never. My dad, for they the can life never of him, it. He, but like my dad, like growing up, he like their whole family had dogs and cats. He would always be like, "What's her name?" And I'm like, "What? You pick the dog. It's a guy." You, the you dick is on the ground. <laughs> oh Jesus! Yeah. Look for it, dude. My my dad can't. Uh, he can't assess age to anyone. Like we'll be like at Starbucks and, and you're like, oh, she's so cute. I'm like, bruh. Don't say that. She is 16 at the most. Like he can't, he has no idea. And then and then he'll look Why at- Why are you outing your dad like that, dude? <laughs> well, dude he's, not, <laughs> he's not doing anything illegal. He's just, Close enough. No. He's not not. It's knocking on the door, but he didn't open it. It's what locked. <laughs> Well, they? I don't know what it is, it's, but- It's Boca Raton. Yeah, uh, yeah, of course, it. of course. It, well, it's also just Florida. Yeah, you both like, ah, oh, dad, that, that's an iguana. All right, yeah. I'll beat. I don't know what it is, but my dad's been with the same woman for ten years. He'd probably fuck a crocodile, no problem. Nice. There you go. What what's happening with the hairless cats? Can we can we assess this? What what happened with the like? Wh I, where's the fur? It's like a face tat of an animal. It's like but a, like what happened? Why why does it need no fur? I don't know. I just is think, it in the desert? Aren't they kind of high maintenance? Because don't you have to like put lotion and stuff on their skin? Really? Like Doesn't a it get dry? Like extra dry? Of course, dry? because there's no fur. What yeah. is it? It looks like a cowboy boot with fucking with it's like organs a naked inside. Mole rat. I'm sick of it, and I don't, I don't think they should exist. I think they're so cute. <laughs> you think they're cute? Yeah, they're like, but they're ugly cute. Thank you. Right. Yeah, like, it's like you're so ugly that I just want to take care of you. Like a bulldog. It's like pathetic. Yeah, what's like a bulldog? Dog? Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. a dog yeah. that's like always hideous. frowning, but it has like big little beady eyes. My a friend bo has a one. Boston Terrier? Uh, no. Frenchie? They, they, they look like they're always like frowning. Oh, yeah, no, Frenchie. I, I think like you're right. Frenchie. Frenchie. Frenchies Frenchies are hideous. Do the, yeah, but they're the best. But <laughs> that's a good But they're so cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I like love Frenchies. Like Tonka trucks just slobbering everywhere. They live like, f yeah, no, that, right? No, it's not that. Type oh, really? Like, Bulldog. Type in like frowning dog. That dog lives like six years. Yeah, but it's also, isn't it like 40K? They have a lot of health problems. Oh, yes. mid, uh, yeah, that one. Uh, well, I don't know. Wait, I think oh, that a pug? that's- No, 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 no. My friend has one. It's like, it like- Oh no! But it's always like frowning. <laughs> frowning dog breed. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Those guys. Yeah, that one. What is that? That dumb son That's of a an bitch. Alien. That no, was no, a no, Men what, in what Black. Is, what is the name? It's a Griffin dog. Griffin dog. Brussels what, Griffin. Damn, Isn't that what Ewoks are based off of? Is it? I'm pretty confident. That's if what you look up what, e like if uh, yes. 
I'm oh. sure. Yes, yeah, yeah. Look at look at one up close. It looks exactly like an Ewok. Oh, oh, I want an Ewok. Shit. Ewoks. Damn, they were in Ewoks movies and would shit. be fire. Look at that. God damn. Kansas City just added Trevor Wallace for shows October 13th and 14th, Friday, Saturday, Kansas City, Australia, Melbourne, Brisbane, Sydney, Perth on sale now at the end of October, October 25th through October 30th. Go pull up TrevorWallaceComedy.com, Australia, live. Michael Blaustein, stand-up comedy. Where am I going to be? Uh, Nashville, Tennessee. We just added a sixth show, October 5th to the 7th. Go grab tickets. Um, October 20th, I'll be in Philadelphia. There's a few tickets left. And then uh, October 21st, I will be in the Wilbur Theater, Boston, Massachusetts. We added a show. There's a few tickets left for the late show. So go get tickets before you cannot. Go to blogcomedy.com. That is blogcomedy.com. More dates on the website. God damn. Ladies and gents, when I don't sleep, I can't go to the gym, okay? And when I don't sleep, I look like a pile of freaking laundry, bro. And that's why I need Next Evo Naturals, buddy. Regular CBD oil just doesn't mix with our water-based body. And I don't know if you know, but our body has a lot of freaking water, okay? Splash, dude. Next Evo Natural products are clinically proven to help your body absorb CBD four times, four, 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 four times better than regular CBD oil, okay? When you need to be de-stressed like we all freaking do, it's 2023, it's so gosh darn stressful, and sleep better this fall, reach for the fast-acting CBD products from Next Evo, okay? It's simple. They absorb better, contain 100% of the CBD listed on the label, are clinically tested, and are delicious with no hempy aftertaste. Gotta hate that freaking aftertaste. And these gummies work fast with absorption starting in just 10 minutes, dude. And they've got two kinds, and ladies and gents, I have used both, and they're so freaking incredible, okay? One kind is Next Evo Sleep Support Complex, okay? It combines premium CBD with the melatonin, so you can wake up refreshed and keep your sleep schedule on track even during the first First few chaotic weeks of fall, okay? The second one is Next Evo Stress CBD Complex, which combines premium CBD with ashwagandha to soothe away stress and stay calm as you get back into your routines. All right, so get more Z's and more Zen in your life. Upgrade to better natural solutions with Next Evo Naturals. Go to nextevo.com and use promo code SOCKS to get 25% off. That is 25% off at N-E-X-T-E-V-O dot com. Promo code SOCKS. Guys, go get some sleep. Go get some more Zen. Stiff socks approved. God damn. So what's going on? What's what's going on in life with me and Malkova? The Return, episode two. I'm looking to get out of California. Really? Oh. I want to move by Saving on taxes? Yeah. There you go, lady. Do you want to guess where I'm going? Texas. 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 Texas? Florida. Florida. One more guess. Connecticut. Oh, shit. No, no, no. Hold on. That wasn't Hawaii. my guess. Hawaii. No. Puerto Rico. Yeah. Really? I'm trying. I'm trying. Oh, really? I want it, to. Why? I mean, obviously for taxes, but. <laughs> also, it's just a beautiful tropical island. Is that where uh, Logan Paul lives? I think so. Is he the mayor out there? Yes. Okay. He should be. Everybody's moving. <laughs> From should here. we? Dude, I tried to get us to move to Austin. Thank God you said why, no. Why I are tried. you guys here, though? Great question. I, Texas is too much. I grew up it's in California. Half, like, 50%, right? It's not great. Maybe for, yeah. No. It's not great. He's the reason we're here. Me? He, no, because you grew up in California. I totally agree. If if so we started this podcast in like DC. Oh, yeah, I would, let's take it to Maryland. No, I don't yeah, want to. Great guess. Oh, Dungeonous Crab again. Again. Let me guess. Under the sea. Shut up. Yeah, we met in Los Angeles. Fell in love. Open relationship. Uh, <laughs> we do have an open relationship. I can't believe I let you smash other people. I'm fucking pissed. That's crazy because you never let me smash. So you could just ask. All right. All right. But grew up in California my whole life, so I just like pretty much loved it here. What part of California? Southern California, like an hour away. A town called Camarillo. Oh, we have an wow. outlet mall and donuts. And I've told the story before. You used to be able to show your tits and get free I donuts. I used to go to Camarillo outlet mall all the time. Really? Yeah, because I grew up in Hemet. Oh, yes. Yeah. What's Hemet? It's in the Inland Empire. Ah. Inland, what is it about the Inland Empire that makes you want to do drugs? It's there's boring. So, yeah, there, it's boring. And really? there's a lot of drugs. You, you guys are talking about <laughs> outlet malls. So, boring. I used to get dressed up to go to Walmart. Really? Yeah. First of all, I would I literally would... spend hours doing my makeup to go walk around Walmart. Walmart and would, that was my place. childhood. Really? <laughs> Walmart's the best place. No. It's, yeah, no, 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 no I it's so Walmart. fun. <laughs> we, I used to get high as shit in college and just roam Walmart. It was so fun. I would knock Where over did a basketball. You grow up? 
Maryland. Yeah. Oh. Maryland. Yeah, when I was uh, in Maryland, I we didn't do there. we didn't do anything but just do fucking <laughs> just we go to malls, <laughs> go to malls, eat crabs, get eat crabs. crabs. Nice. Women, whores. I don't know why. <laughs> in Maryland, or yeah, just dude, a Maryland. Statement? I, no, no, no. Just dude in Maryland. I don't know what happened in the DMV, DC, Maryland, Virginia. Women That's what the stands out here. Yeah. Not the actual DMV. The actual no, DMV know, where you get your but, license. But I know, but I never questioned it. Yeah, yeah, DMV. Damn. DC, Maryland, Virginia. And I don't know what it was. Maybe the people that I ran with, loose <laughs> gooses, but I mean, loose, dude. Crazy. You've heard stories? I don't yeah. know what it is. People loose around where you lived? Have it? I don't. People open for no. business? Labias thrown around? Oh, you know. <laughs> no one threw a labia around? So you went to Walmart, didn't throw one labia around? <laughs> This is bullshit. I wasn't nah. in the cool crowd. That's, that's I don't TJ Maxx activities right there. A hundred percent. That's Ross. Yeah. Have you ever fucked in a dressing room? No. Huh? Why are you surprised? I, don't know. By I that? haven't either. I haven't either. It gets so quiet in there, and you're like, "Do you need any more sizes?" You're like, "I need a bigger dick." Yeah. I don't. I, not anywhere where you can actually get caught. Like that's really? just terrifying. I, got, I hate it. He loves it. I fucking hate I it. I get topped off in the bird. No, I'm, ta- I'm scared. I'm like, that would be so awkward. It would. I, so do you. So you don't like public? No. Where's your favorite place? Just like in a bedroom. The bed or the couch? Like, yeah, very dude, I'm easy. a big couch guy all of a sudden. I, I don't like, know what happened. I wasn't a couch guy. Last two women were like well, don't on you, the couch. Don't you like cuddle and watch TV? Cuddle and watch TV? Like, I'm like, not a fucking loser. Like... <laughs> I'm trying to beat. <laughs> <laughs> what I the did, fuck do you do on the, the couch? The spontaneousness. You start on the couch. Couch is like an appetizer. Yes. Like, Let's go yeah. to the main course. Yeah. Yeah, What's exactly. the dessert? Exactly. S. <laughs> what? <laughs> that is true. The couch. That's so funny. Couch. Whoever invented couch is like, this is great for sitting. And people are like, Sitting? You mean fucking doggy style? That's the only time I like doggy style. On the it's couch? Like, not on the couch when she's leaned over, like on the arm of the couch, and she's leaned over, and I'm standing up, and I have to put phone books underneath me because I'm 5'9". You know the little stairs you have for your dog to get on there? Yep, Do I've done use it. That? I can't because I'm too heavy. Yep, 151. What's good? Is that how much you weigh? Yeah. I think we weigh the same. What? I think I weigh more than you. No, you don't. I swear. There's no way. I think I'm 170. I will, I will, uh, you're 131. Most. I think I have a lot of muscle. Definitely you are. not. No, you're fucking jacked. I'm really not, but I I do. I'm strong enough. I, yeah. I think that a lot. You of just told muscle. me you lift up. Oh, speak. You you we were talking off mic. You told me that you are like a water connoisseur. Whoa. Kind of. I just Avatar. I, yeah. What, what what type of water? Aquafina. <laughs> Avatar. Last water. Oh, that's. Last- <laughs> What, what do you mean water kind of I just, I just, uh, I love water. It's my favorite beverage. It's like my favorite thing to do. I literally it have like, like 64 ounces, yep. a 64 it's ounce water bottle. Yeah, I just, I love, like I call it hydrating. <laughs> what about like, what about like, <laughs> hold so on, hold on. I'm, I'm and I drink in, I'm water in. all day. <laughs> hold on, hold on. You need some hobbies. Do you like golf? I'm a, Tennis? I like to stay home. I'm a hermit. I'm the definition of a hermit. So what? So yeah. when you shoot, you just tell people to come through? No, I'll leave if I have oh. to. Oh. Okay. Like, I don't want them in my space. True. Yeah, I hear that. <laughs> Is it one of those water bottles that like has hours on the side of it? Like no. Seven no, because eight. I like fill that up four times. Yeah, I drink a lot of Do water. Do you pee a lot? Yeah. Do you, you have pee to. on people? No. All right. But I have. We trying to make this somebody about sex somehow. So have you peed your mind on somebody? Out of the no, but I'm a, I'm an open book. I would if a girl. See, here's the if thing. She I, wanted it. Yes, yeah. that's super hot to me. If a girl, if a girl has like a kink and she really gets off to it, if she's like hit me with a Harry Potter book, like I would do. Like if she, if that's the thing that she loved. Do you have Harry Potter books on deck? I don't, but I would buy them if she was into them. Amazon Prime. Oh shit! Yeah, yeah. But we interviewed Alexis Fox. Alexis Fox. I said it right. Yeah. And she said if she's doing a scene where she needs to fucking hit the splash zone, she drinks a lot of water. Yeah. So is that No, I've I've fluctuate? said this. I've been peed on so many times. It's oh, because like say that the, again. I have been peed on so many times. Here we go. <laughs> and it's not <laughs> it's not my favorite thing. It just takes too long. <clears throat> well, no, it's because when I, when I do a scene with a girl and it's like 
performative to like squirt a lot of the time they're just drinking a ton of water and they start pissing and then to like get into it one i'm getting pissed on and then i'm like getting down there with my tongue and like acting like it's squirt so i'm just drinking pee at the same time always pee which is not even bad like it's not something that i'm like oh this is terrible it's fine usually they're very hydrated it's more on the clear side but it's not like it's nothing i like it's kind of like if you're such a water connoisseur do you know which water they drank and you're like Ooh, Perrier. No, okay. I try to like just get it out of my mind. Well, I, was thinking- I don't. I'm I'm nasty though. I don't even always shower afterwards. Like I don't like it, but at the same time, I'm like it's fine. Uh, yeah, yeah. You <laughs> just I'm, like I'm go, go to you bed go to, like this. You go to sleep with that. Yeah. With urine all over you. <laughs> Madam, hold on. It's the thought that I counts. I just don't care. Hold on, but but you there, you you're soaked in pee, and then you go home and you brush your teeth. You put you 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 do your face wash and blah blah blah. Yeah, take the dogs maybe, out to pee. Yeah, maybe I don't want to take a shower. Maybe that's too much effort. I feel you. I just had a long day. Yes, but you have. But can we flag that you have urine on you? Can we just say that? Yeah, but don't you don't you finish on your chest and then yes. just roll right to sleep? Well, I, yeah, I, I, you just I, like wipe it off I wipe a little it off. bit, so yeah, you yeah. have like remnants of cum on you. It's oh, the same dude, thing. I. Dude, I got <laughs> coffee today with a cum stain directly on my tit. What? Like on the shirt. It was like right Why here. Why did it? Oh, I understand. Who? I understand how that happened. How? Yeah, thank you. It like facing upwards. Ah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Because sometimes, here's the thing. Sometimes I start jerking off with my shirt on like an idiot. And then I'm too lazy. I'm like rocking. Winnie the Pooh. Under rocked it. What are you doing? <laughs> Funny. <laughs> but so when I come... I'll just when I feel like I'm about to come, I just lift my shirt up like a like a bib, like a bib, and then so I shot it. And you I know got how it. like people used to do the Britney where they would, like tuck their shirt right <laughs> <over> here and <laughs> do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I swear I just do this, and then I I got. Well, I didn't think I did. It was dark, but I think uh, I, I mean obviously I did. You seem like the type of person that's tasted their own cum. Oh yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. He was mad at me that I hadn't tried it. Thank you, see, not everyone does this. I don't say that about you. (laughs) Thank you, thank you. It doesn't. It doesn't. It. I've been complimented, and I don't taste my own shit. Taste. It just. It tastes nothing. Like you know, it's funny. Something I used to do. Yes. Okay. But it's kind of gross. I used to like finger myself, and then I'd put it on my lips because I just like the way it tastes. Like chapstick. Like chapstick. But that says a lot about you. You have a good pH balance. You know, I'm just like that's nice. <laughs> what, 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 like, what? How old were you? Say above eighteen. How no, old? No, no, no. <laughs> Twenty five. I was like, doing it for years. Then you'd kiss like a man, or just for you? Yeah, sure. Like, but yeah, I, I don't so exactly announce to them. That's what I did. Right. <laughs> would you like Birth come? Bees? Would you come and then do no, it, or no, you just like? I, no, I was just like fill the wetness and then pull it out and like use it where I wanted it. <laughs> what would you use it for? Oh. Like, like instead of like Pam on like you just use and, it for eggs. Yeah, That's <laughs> just <what> anywhere. <laughs> no, chapstick was the main thing. <laughs> so this uh, this is an article that talks about how cum, actual semen, is a type of chapstick. It has enzymatic and Show me proteolytic properties of, uh, that'll that'll repair chapped lips. Cum really? Does? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but that's a guy who's like trying to like get it yeah. on with his wife. Okay. He's like, baby, 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 come here. butter, you know? <laughs> like, yeah. that tastes a lot better. <laughs> just get some Carmax and you're all right. God damn. Buddy, you know what I'm sick of? Running out of freaking Stiff Stocks episodes. You know what we can do for you? Why don't you sign up for the freaking Patreon or the Stiff Stocks Plus, dude? Four extra episodes drops every Friday, ad free for only $5. That is less than a cup of freaking coffee. Go grab it, okay? And you have access to the Discord. And if you're an Apple consumer, there's Stiff Stocks Plus audio version only, but the same amazing bonus content, all right? The bonus episodes have been crazy the last couple of weeks, too. You guys are on fire. Buddy? I'm in fuego, as they say in Japan, in fuego. Because here's the thing, man, on Patreon, you know, our parents don't listen. So we get a little wild and you get a free week. So go sign up, listen to some stuff. And if you like it, continue. If you don't, psych, you will. Doesn't matter. All right, guys. So patreon.com backslash stiff socks pod. And if you're an Apple consumer, it is just on the freaking phone. So click a button. Boom, bang, bang. It's on your feed. Spotify too now. Buddy forgot Spotify too. Yep. Cool. So go do it. We love you. Support the podcast. God damn. I don't think it beat on that bad. I think it's the first I, th- I think the first 15 seconds is kind of nice. If it's in it's your mouth warm. and they're not hydrated, Hold it's on. bad. Oh, we, did we just discover that you got No, but on? I'm saying like oh, you're the just saying he, you don't like a warm can, shower? Hold on, stop. Did you have you been peeing on? No. But Sir? I've peed on myself. There you go. I have to. It actually does feel good. In it feels really nice. It does. What yeah. is that? 
Dude, sometimes I think like I got stung oh, by a jellyfish. The beginning is warm. <laughs> have either of you peed in a swimming pool since you've been an adult? Oh, yeah. Oh, I, I peed, peed literally yesterday. Yeah, All the two time, weeks ago. right? I don't, not even when I'm in it. I just walk out. Yeah. Yeah. out. so gross. I, I know I'm, shit I'm, in I'm guilty of it, too. I, of I see people in Las Vegas at like the pool parties, and I'm like, why are you in this? <laughs> this is scabies in the water. Well, once again, we don't think pee's that bad. Isn't it antiseptic? Antiseptic? The pee? Septic. Hold on, pee doesn't like juice? Did you say pee's on the Maybe I'm... He wait, did. Wait, he said that. I said, I'm, I'm Jewish. I can say it. <laughs> pee on me. But, wait. Septic? There's yes. no filtration? It prevents the growth of disease-causing microorganisms. What does? Pee? Uh, that's what antiseptic means. Right, but... Is what, is, what, is, what is pee... Does pee hate Jews or does it not hate Jews? Pee is uh, not a sterile substance. Wait, yeah, but, but, but Sarah, what does that mean? Doctor but, but, fucking. But, but, but when you look at the pool, <laughs> you're going too fast. <laughs> Maybe I'm you, talking shit. I don't know. <laughs> but when you look at the pool, it looks like cloudy. It looks like the water is vaping in there. It doesn't escape. Like it's not good looking water. But, like no, my cl but chlorine, say, chlorine kills it all. Chlorine in the pool. No, it that's, is. Why, that's why there's so that's much why chlorine. They, have, they, they yeah, need really? that as well. Like uh, like a certain amount of chlorine. So you. Wasn't there someone recently, like a kid, that had um, gotten a brain eating. I hate this. Amoeba. Amoeba, yeah. From a public swimming pool? I read oh, this like a month probably. ago. That stuff and it's because the public swimming pool didn't have like the correct uh, chlorine. pH balance? Yeah, level. chlorine level. God damn, is that true? Oof. I hope not, dude. That is crazy. I think it's true. Yeah, nice maybe Ar Arlington, Texas, it looks like. Yeah, yeah. 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 Wow. Nice. Oof. But at least you don't have to do chores anymore. Take the trash out. I have a brain eating amoeba, Dad. Well, I think he died. Oh! <laughs> doesn't have to do chores anymore. There we go. Yeah, that's what I he can do his chores in heaven. God. Huh? Would you? I don't know. I just feel like getting peed on would be kind of lit. It's kind of warm. <laughs> Listen, I'm, I'm, I'm. It's like a fondue. I think this is you it's really like coming out that you. It's like a fondue. Say it He's again. Convinced. Cheese fondue is warm. Pee can be warm. I just think the first 15 seconds isn't bad. Then you get cold. You really want to get peed on? Sure. There I'm you go. I didn't want you to say it. But if a girl likes you enough to pee on you, there's something going on. That's not first day activities. Doesn't everyone get peed on in the shower? If you take yes. a shower yeah. together, you're Joke. peeing on each other. That's like, that's like my favorite like bit when yeah. I had a girlfriend like pee on each other like joking. Yeah. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Goofy. Oh, love. <laughs> Fuck. Soundboard. <laughs> yeah, dude. When she's when she's like when she's like she, when she takes first of all stop hogging all the water you fuck. But anyways, when she's in the front of the water and she's doing it and then you just pee on like you that's and then she goes what are you doing? And you're like peeing on you. She's like, I love you, fuck. Ah, it's so fun. Love, dude. Open relationships. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you didn't you didn't answer me. Do you think that idea can work once a quarter? If you were someone for like, <clears throat> I'm not saying off jump. I'm not saying like month one into the relationship. I'm saying like maybe you're like married. You're six years in. Things are getting a little stale. Personally, I don't because I think that in order to have like a real relationship and, and it, it requires respect and trust for something to last. Okay. And I think even if somebody keeps that from the other person, they're going to behave in ways because they have a guilty conscience. Yeah, that buildup is going to fuck with it. Yeah. No, 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 but, but, but that's... The, the other piece of this is if you execute the the once a quarter, you have to like come home and tell them. Like that's like a part of the openness and transparency of the, of the thing. You don't go on the counter like mark it off, but like you, you know, hey, you know, hey. Are they, are they gonna sit around and say like, but ah, come on. <laughs> <laughs> but for me funnier, like if ever you had like, let's say you had 12 chains like hanging up from like the fireplace and like each one was for a month. And then you come out and then one of her chains is gone. You're like, you fucking got some last night? It is oh, what? But see, oh, that's so say if they cheat, does this what? person now get to go yep. and have a free yeah, pass? Yeah, it's they, equal. Everybody does. Yeah. Everyone does. Oh, but then in that that situation, I feel like it's, it can be like, a, I'm doing this out of spite. Yeah, because then you're trying really to get even. Wanna do it. Yeah. You're just trying to get even. You it is similar it. with open relationships too, whereas if one person has plans, the other person needs to find plans, even if they don't necessarily want them or else they're stuck at home. Like, like what is my partner out there doing? But may maybe I'm a cuck, but I, the thought, maybe. <clears throat> the thought, hey, the thought of my girl coming back, hair disheveled, fucking mascara running, and I go, sit down, here's some chamomile, what happened? Little, this cu little cuckish. Little, right? Yeah. I don't want to see it, but the thought of like her come up it's i don't it's hot to me I'll, I'll be honest that was why i didn't enjoy like my last relationship which was like open i only explored it twice 
And we were together for almost four years. And mm -hmm. that was because the entire time he'd be texting me and messaging me and calling me and being like, what's happening? What's happening? Tell me, blah, blah, blah. Like all oh, this yeah, perverted no. stuff. And yeah. I'm like, leave me the fuck alone. Like yeah. this isn't about I'm you. I'm trying to get railed down yeah, right yeah. now. Yeah, like, yeah. Like I'm, I'm invested in this person. I don't want to think of you. I think of you all the time. Yeah. You know? And he just couldn't get past it. He couldn't leave me alone. He sent me a voice memo. Was, yeah, 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 exactly. It just Set ruined him. And then even afterwards, I'm like, God, like this is, I'm not sharing this with you. Oh, but see, that's the hottest part. <laughs> I don't want to be. I don't want to do the texting thing that he was doing. That obviously, that's too much. You want to do it but after the yeah. sharing part of it when she like. I think like it's a like book club. Isn't Cut it like club. hot Cut club? Title. Yeah, Is it like good. hot wifeish? <laughs> do you ever watch like the? I've done. I've done scenes like that. Hot, hot wife. wife. Can everyone in porn shut up? I don't <laughs> like You're... the narrative. Am I? Am, I, I, no, I've, already, I've, no, I've already. I've already said, that, and I know that was a very aggressive thing to say. But I just. You, but I. I, I'm what? saying this because last night it was like, and I'm and I'm like, I have to fast forward to eight minutes. I don't. I, what's happening? I don't care. This is your stepdaughter. I don't. None yeah, of but, this matters. But, but some people you know, do. I know. So, I know. I don't understand do like that it? either. No. Thank God. No, I hate it. Like I'm like straight Fuck to penetration. Her. Yes. Yeah, like, <laughs> really? Yeah. You're like, uh, can we take that line back again? You're like, I'm trying to take a dick. What are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> That is interesting. So are, are the directors like very like oh like acting based where they're like oh you you miss that line or you miss that that word? Not usually. I'd I'd say on average so they annoyed. don't give a shit. They're just like just let's get this done because nobody that was like a running joke on set too. Nobody cares about the intros. But if you're doing a feature film where they are like a big part of it is focused yeah, on story. Yeah, we gotta fill an hour ish. Yeah, time. it's an actual movie. Then they care about the acting and they're having you redo it. But it's never yeah you know. I lost some trailer. Never, to a porn movie that's like a Game of Thrones take. What was it called? Game of Bones? I, I wish. I freaking wish. That was very quick. I really appreciate that. I think that's a real thing. I think it is. But it was so funny. You know what Because do. they were like doing scene. They were like doing scene. They were like acting. Take her fur off. What's happening? Like, oh, I'm going to... Yeah, Everyone but, be but, quiet. But imagine if you open it and she just didn't have anything on. You'd be like, there's, there's no build up. You got to build it up. You gotta add yourself with the oh, it's the bras coming off, uh, the the hooves. I don't know what they wear in Game of Thrones. The the helmet. Yeah, you, the drag. Neither one of you watch hentai, do you? Because I feel like they don't shut up. Uh -uh. Oh really? No. Uh -uh. I watched one recently, and it's, I did. I was getting mad because there was so much talking, but then I realized it said porn <laughs> interview, and I was like, well, I'm wrong here. To be honest. <laughs> yeah, then you're like, this is plug talk. <laughs> 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 Have you done that? Yeah. You have? Do you but I, no, not with Adam. Um, just, huh? with, just with Lena. We went like oh, at each other with a strap on. That's amazing. Where was Adam? Was he like, I'm out of office today, but you got you girls have fun. He did actually leave. He just, really? Yeah, he just Hold lost somebody. He had to leave early. What? For what? How are you going to, what, for well, a no, 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 I said no because I don't shoot with boys. When, when did this come into play? Since I got into a relationship. Oh, that's that's your thing. So relationships uh, can't. Yeah. Oh, that makes actually that makes a lot of sense. Well, no, the last one, the last one, it wasn't the case. Um, but like going into this one, that's that was just my decision. And I, I'll be perfectly honest. It's not like I want that to always be the case. It just feels like right right now. Like okay. I, I'm not. I don't feel like I'm missing anything. I don't think you're missing anything either. I yeah. think the man at home. He. <laughs> So okay, so so you obviously there's a rule. So that's why Adam didn't join. I thought mm -hmm. you were saying that he like needed no, to no, 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 no. take chicken out of the oven. He was like, oh, I'm not gonna fuck me, Malco. I have to go do yeah. the chicken. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, crazy. No. Okay, I had no idea. So when was the last scene with a man? Or years ago? Um, it was Kieran Lee, and that was bring him up almost two years ago. Here's the thing. If I was that guy, I'd have such big ego. I'd be like, I was the last one. Well, 100%. it was Kieran Lee, and then a week before, it was Johnny Sins. And those were like the only two that I shot with Jesus. while I was single. So like, I, I hit it in oh, one yeah. month. Yeah, yeah. I, you kind of have mark. to. <laughs> if, if, you're back, if you're back out there, you got to get the top yeah, dogs. Exactly. I met him. He's a very nice man. But I think the internet makes this guy like so big, and you meet him, he's like so normal. I was like. Oh, he's so normal. He, he's just chill. He's yes. so nice. Yeah, he's, he's down to so earth. Nice, he likes dude. his space. He likes to just, you know, go I know around this guy. and travel. His penis was insured for a million dollars? I know this guy. Dude, How? I've taken pointers from this guy. Kieran really? Lee's very nice as well. He's, he he's fucks a very like nice guy. Nice. What do you mean? He, does, huh? he fucks like and a nice When you mean nice, what does this mean? Well, I mean nice because I've I've known him for like 10 years. Um, and my ex-husband, they used to be friends. So, like, I they'd go around and, um, like, we'd come to dinner and stuff like that. 
And funny enough, when I was with my ex-husband, who was in the adult industry, like he was off limits. He was like, no, you can't work with him. Because he's so, so good this, at fucking. Or they're just he, he friends. Just had, yeah, they, they were friends. Oh, they and were he friends, had that right? boundary. That's more, that's well, more they weren't friends when we separated. Enemies? I just, I, I don't know. I don't know. I would just yeah, say yeah. not friends anymore. So when I separated from him, like the first thing I did is uh, oh, an anal scene. Wow. See, there that's why go. I'm scared. You fall in love with a girl <laughs> and you're like, oh, you're a coworker. He's like, it's just a friend. The second you guys break up, guess who I was always, I'll be HR honest, room. I was always curious. <laughs> really? It's like, why is he off but limits? <laughs> do you think it has anything to do, like, growing up, my parents were like, don't do drugs, don't smoke weed. Then in the back of my head, I was like, I fucking want to smoke weed now. So the fact that your ex husband was like, don't bang him. It definitely, like, fuck him. definitely added to it. Yeah. yeah d- if you tell me not to do something, now I want to do that thing. Yes, exactly. Don't commit arson. Well, whereas, guess what I'm doing Tuesday. Whereas otherwise, otherwise, <laughs> Honestly, I would have anyway, though. If I, He would have been somebody that I definitely right. would have well, shot yeah. with and been on like my rotation. Well, yeah, they're just two very popular names in the industry, so mm-hmm. it makes sense you guys would work together. It's not like you were like going after him to be like, oh, I'm getting back to my husband. Maybe you a know. little bit. No, no, I, would, I, I just wanted to work with him anyway. Mm. So when you did, when you finished the scene, did you realize why your ex-husband didn't want you to fuck him? Ooh. <laughs> no. You didn't? You weren't like, no. whoa. No. Is there ever a dude, there ever a dude that... what? Okay, I don't even know if you can answer this. Is there a dude who who's the best fuck that you've got in the industry? I mean, we could try. I mean, I, a couple names come to mind. Great. So like my favorites were Manuel Ferrara. Is that the skinny guy who's packing? No, he's French, but he's packing. <gasps> no, no, I, that, no. That, there's a guy no, on Brazzers. Like, they tattooed, right? I don't think he is. No, there's some guy that I literally <laughs> watched to take pointers from. That's him. I don't think you should ever take por- pointers from porn stars. No, no, no. Really? Why? No, no, no. But this it's fantasy. No, no. But can I say this? But Hold this, on. Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean? It's fantasy. Like this girls don't real? actually want to be treated like that. Whoa. Most women. Let me. Can I oh, say some something? Some of them. Some can of I them. Say them do. No, they're whores. You oh, like whores. Buddy, I know you like whores. Yeah. <laughs> let me. T- wait. There are some out there. That are into it. Yes, yes, okay, okay, whores. Okay, okay. <laughs> nice lady nice is what lady. we call them. <laughs> no, I love whores, but I think the majority of women don't. Yeah, I, uh, I've hooked up with um, one adult actress, and I was so... Who? Uh, I'll tell you off camera. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. But... I was like nervous. I was like, I don't think I'm gonna be able to put. A, I mean, this guy is like a forearm for a cock, and I'm over here just, you know, I'm, I'm all right. Golf pencil, yeah. you know. I got the little Wetzel's pretzels, hot dog, and a bun type of. It's not bad. But I just was so in my head, and then like I was like in my head, I was like, I had seen her work before, and I was waiting for the moans, and I was like, oh damn, she's taking a bye week. Oh, it's not no. good. I was I was waiting for the ah, and you know, but it's still really good. But I was in my head the whole time. Yeah. But then actually we started hooking up. It was very normal. I didn't even think about it. If I'm being honest, that's one of the reasons as well. I'm not a ter- like I'm very picky about who I would sleep with off camera because like it was a lot of pressure for me. Oh shit. Yeah. I didn't think oh, they about would, that. Yeah, I would feel like they 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 know who I am, like they've watched my stuff and they're expecting something that they're just not going to get. <laughs> like, I think my first thought was that, but then when it happened I was like, "Oh, this is so normal." Yeah. I'm in, in my head. I'm saying, yeah. I'm really? in my head the whole time. Yeah. I'm like putting on a little bit of a performance so I but can't like you, fully enjoy it. Do you yeah. feel like if a guy is uh, like easily impressed because like maybe they are so amateur and you're like, oh, really? This is what does it for you? This is a Tuesday for me. And the guy's like, what the fuck? I'm really good at giving head. I know that. But it's like, like uh, but that's a so talent. I've like, heard. yeah, practice but, like but makes perfect. Are those guys <laughs> like, oh, what, what is happening? <laughs> What's going on down there? Where did you learn this? Wiki feet? How, how do you learn this? Wiki how? I would. Do you do you like commentate while you're having sex? Yeah, like, mentally I'm like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Because I will say that. Oh my god, where'd you learn this? Yes, but like I'm just literally a Pornhub comment just in person. But in my head, I want to like give compliments, and I'm like, you know, because there's the generic. Oh, it's the best head of my life. Blah blah blah. We're just we're hitting the classics. But you want to be like. I want to like let them know like what the f- how who this is crazy yeah because then they're fired up they're gassed yeah. up like, oh my god um, yeah I, so I agree I, do you feel like uh, an average like a normal guy would or an average guy I guess would just be like 
more impressed by your work, obviously? Potentially. Also, okay. like, I have a really nice face, so I'm something to look at. And then, like, usually you're in, like, a sloped up position, so I have, like, the nice ass, too. I'm always looking for a reaction. Are you the feet up Ah, crossed? the reaction. Not really, oh, but if, if if that's what they were in too short, I would cross the feet. Yes. My nice husband had a, a big foot fetish. So like what my, a my feet my feet were always in his face. <laughs> like, Fuck <laughs> Yeah, but, I mean that that clip almost got Michael out of a relationship. Oh right. No, what happened? Oh. Remember the What happened? With, oh, dude. I'm sorry. No, no, no. 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 Apologize. It was my like forty fault. million views. Yeah. It was great. <laughs> no, dude, it was oh my god. I'm stu I okay. All, I'll take full accountability for this. This is all my fault. Yeah, no shit. <clears throat> hey! <laughs> but <clears throat> you you reposted it, and I was stoked that you reposted it. Mm -hmm. So I literally showed my girl. I was like, oh my God, me reposted this is fucking crazy. And I showed it to her, and then she like, she's like, and she was like, oh, cool, cool. And then she watched the clip, and the, the fucking temperature in the room dropped. Yeah. She was so whatever. Oh. And she wasn't like... She wasn't. She was just mad about my like reaction. You're, yeah, to of it. course. You reacted I was like, too strongly. Yeah, because I was freaking out. And then she probably ah. believed you too. I, she, but that, I know. <laughs> she but was that's, like, this wasn't for entertainment, you motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I was yeah. totally joking. <laughs> Toe. Literally. <laughs> um, but yeah, so she like, and I, the, the one comment that she like absolutely couldn't stand was, I go, this is the best moment of my life. Mm. <laughs> Like, all that time we spent when we hiked Machu Picchu, this is the best moment of your life. I literally <laughs> screamed, this is the best moment of my life. And she was like, she was like, yeah, I'm gonna walk around with you. This fucking clip did like 40 minutes. She's like, say, I'm gonna walk around with you and people are gonna like think that I made it, which is a very valid point. But the yeah, but I screamed that this is the best moment of my you life. You should have like read out the clip and be like, this is the here. second best moment of my life. <laughs> yeah, this is in my top 10 best moments. This is a very cool experience. Experience. Nothing like anything I've done with my girlfriend. Yeah, dude, it was like it was a thing. And the dude, what the worst, worst, you'll get kicked out of this. The worst thing is, I think like the next week, because I told her I was like, no one's gonna get her, but everyone understands the performance, right? And I think mm -hmm. most people do, right? Yeah. The next week, I had a show in New York. <clears throat> it was like a pretty big show, and I was like halfway through my set. I think I told you this, and someone yelled out, "What about Mia's feet?" Ah. Uh. And she was there. And she Did you try to change was it? upset. And I didn't like, respond. She's that? like, what about my... Okay, this might make her feel better. My feet are fucked up. I have like a little Franken foot now. What happened? I had... Look. Still, does, it doesn't... I don't care. Um, <laughs> I do... I do. I have like I, a two-inch scar. Wait, what happened? I think that might have been... I've seen... I've, I've seen the rumblings, but I don't know yeah. what happened. Oh, well, I was doing a photo shoot... Um, and it was inside of a glass box. And um, I think that the, the guy who was taking the photos, I think that he had um, leaned on the top and the top was a heavy piece of wood with plexiglass glued oh, to it. No. So it just came down and chopped my foot down to oh the bone. To the bone for real? To the bone for real, yeah. Odd too, that man. It was, yeah, I don't know why it was, it it was visible. God damn. Yeah. I mean, oh, I think this happened right around when we filmed the sketch that we did. Maybe. Did I have a boot on? I had to have like a boot for there like was a, four some, months. You had a boot at some point for something. I think so. Okay, then that was, that was it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God. I mean, was it like one of the worst, like, was it the worst pains you ever felt? It had to be crazy. You know, honestly, no. I think I went into shock right away. Yeah. Like pretty much instantly, I just kind of, I Ooh. covered my foot. Yeah. So I didn't even see it because it, it did hurt then. And then I was like, I saw some blood coming up oh, under well, my hand. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, yeah, yeah. I was like, can you go get me something? And when they came back and I lifted up to put the towel on, uh -huh. I saw what it was. And yeah. it was like, it was bad. I posted a picture of it. Damn. Um, uh. it but by then I had went into shock. So like, I didn't really feel anything. Like I, I did call 911 and like I was taken in an ambulance and I was kind of just like, like laughing and joking the whole way. Yeah. And I was like, wait, yeah, I know this voice. Yeah, okay. Oh, your foot again. Let me guess, the dishwasher next? Yeah. He, yeah, he walks in and he's like, I'm a real paramedic. I'm a real one. Has this ever happened, and, and excuse me if this is dumb, but 
have you ever got like Postmates or something and they like open the door and they see you and they're like, is this going to happen? No, but I have like done, like I was trying to get something notarized online and it was like Which through an app. Horny. And I'm on the phone with the guy who's like ver- verifying it and I have to like send my ID through the app. Yeah, and he yeah. looks at the ID and he's like, oh, I know you. But we're not going to talk about that. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. But I feel like you probably get a lot of those looks, just like being at the airport or wherever. People are just like, why do I know you? Why do I know you? Ah. Uh, you do- know, I don't know because I'm like, I'm very like in my own head when I'm wandering around. I'm trying mm. to like, I have a bit of social anxiety, so I'm not trying to like pay attention at, yeah. to everyone else. Yeah, but yeah. when I am with other people, they're like, oh, that person recognized you. That person like. Oh, they're looking yeah. out for you? Yeah. Interesting. Damn. So, okay, so how long how long did it take to, like, get there? How long ago was the foot incident? I think it was two years. Almost two years. That was, been, that was two years ago? Not, not, a, Dude, full two, not a full two years. I know it goes like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, but, yeah, basically they, they stitched it up. I think it had, like, 13 stitches or something like that. And um, I couldn't stay off of it. I, I stayed off of it for like two weeks, but yeah. I there was like a streamer awards thing that I really wanted to go to. And so I wandered around like pretty much with a big boot and then nothing except like my wrapped up little foot. And I ended up popping open the stitches oh. that night. So like they had to, I had to go and get it restitched and it just like fucked the scar up and made it take a lot longer. And then also I couldn't fit my foot into a, a sneaker for half a year. So you your wear? feet were just out? Yeah, I was just in the. Sucks, I would dude. I would wear the little boot because that was the only thing my foot would fit in. Yeah, that does suck. Sucks. Too. Uh, it, I wear it, one of those it, boots. It looked get free terrible. Parking. No one would want that like nasty ass like Franken foot near them. Franken foot. <laughs> I'm not. Like I'm, listen, I'm not out. I'm not out. I know you're like, oh, this scar, blah blah blah. Fine. Really? Yes. I mean that that makes me feel better about feet. Scars are in the hot. <laughs> yeah. Watch what you say though. What do you mean? <laughs> what about your girlfriend? Oh, oh no, I'm I'm single now, so oh, I'm, I'm okay. yeah, 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 yeah. ended it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's, oh, no. fuck. <laughs> Could you imagine taking down her this relationship and you're like, Ugh. shit? There was We're number three in the apple chart, dude. Babe. I know there were. She alluded to it. Really? She alluded to it. Yeah. Oh, this that was, was like something she held on to. She alluded to it, yeah. and I actually asked, and she's like, no, I don't like. I won't want you to do that. Whatever, whatever. But like, she definitely was like, it was. I was. Yeah. It was not okay. Not mm. okay. But you know, you know, you live, you, you learn. Laugh, you love. Yeah. You live, laugh, love. So if you walk into a girl's apartment, yes. And she has that inner kitchen, where are you at? Has what? The live, laugh, love thing. You about to get some real bad head, I'll tell you that much. Really? I'm live, yeah. laugh, leaving. <laughs> I hate those inspirational me quotes too. too. It's so cringy. I'm like, you're that type of person. You know what I hate? Me. I'm wine mom. You're an alcoholic. <laughs> Pick your kids up from soccer, you horrible mom. I hate it. I'm just a. It's eleven. It's eleven. Your husband's on business. He's fucking his secretary in Tahiti right now, and you're not picking your kids up from gymnastics. What's the male equivalent of a live, laugh, love? Like font in the kitchen. In the kitchen, uh, yeah, hats on the wall. Yeah, hats on oh. the wall. Yeah, a full send photo, <laughs> or whatever the fuck, not photo. No what? flag. Yeah, no flag. That's what I wanted. Yeah, I'm just trying to think. What does a girl walk into and she goes, "Oh no." Oh yeah, yeah. What that sign is? Um, the live that love one is just tough because it's like anybody that has to tell themselves to remind themselves that that is what they need to be doing. Suicide. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I mean, I. Th- Honestly, I think a lot of people need to remind themselves. Like people have like certain course, routines yeah. when they wake up. Yeah, like they'll write in their dream, like to, like positive affirmations. Yeah, look, yeah we're, like we're, we're just playing this up to yeah. a time. We're just obviously joking, but like yeah. I my here's the thing: if you do that, that's fine. Just don't tell the world. Like my friend posted one day on his his story, his mirror in his bathroom, and he put post notes of all these like positive affirmations. And I just want to be like, listen, man. Don't it's be not that, that guy. Yeah. It's <laughs> the, you, you look, you're five, you six. It was never thing. your brain. It was but you, you the whole time. you can be that guy. I'm, I'm fine with positive, positive affirmations. I'm fine with the posted thing. I'm not fine with posting about it. My Lyft driver on the way here was telling me to like wake up every morning with positive affirmations. So it he does first started work, off talking about astronomy. <laughs> like, okay. Or, or I'm sorry, astrology. And like. What's astronomy? Stars? Yeah. Astrology is stars too, right? But it's or like moons. your star signs. What's pastrami? And, isn't it your star signs and shit? Meat. Nice Cats meat. Deli. So hey. good. Yeah. Meat. Sex. So you're talking about 
uh, just starting your day positive? Yeah, yeah, exactly. He, he, what did he say to me? It was something like, start every morning with, I am wealthy, I'm healthy, and I can do it. He's like, for three weeks. And I was like, well, that's very, very lovely. This but- guy just read Rich Dad, Poor Dad. <laughs> Literally just did. <laughs> Do you wake up with positive affirmations? No, I wake up with coffee. <laughs> there you go. That's yeah, an yeah, adult. Yeah, yeah. Black? Yeah. Coffee? Yeah, if I'm fasting. For anal scenes? <laughs> <laughs> the day? <laughs> we sure had that. Yeah, this boy's hot. <laughs> they done bleached him too far. His brain's cooked. It's <laughs> to the roots. I can't say anything. Anal? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> bleach them too far. It's so the funny. boy done bleached past the point of no return. Yeah, Michael. People can fast just because they want to. <laughs> but it was for anal, right? Yes. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. No, I, I never understood that growing up. My mom would always be like, don't talk to me until my coffee. I'd be like, yeah, okay, Cheryl, chill. But like now, no, that, I get it. Yeah, that's how I am. Crazy. Too. Yeah, I, I'm like, insane. don't ask me to do anything. My cat now is like, you my... again. <laughs> yeah. Dude, it's crazy. That's crazy. I don't know. What is that? <clears throat> Dude, I the saw... The second you wake up, you're depending and you're needy. Here's <laughs> oh, Shut immediate. up. I'd die so fast in a war. Dude, uh, yeah, immediately. Yeah. What Immedi- time's war call? 7 a.m.? That's, That's crazy. crazy. So I can't shower once? I'm in a <laughs> foxhole? That's insane. I have to shoot Germans? No, bitches. None. I gotta fuck Todd? <laughs> Dude, how mad would you go to take your helmet off and the foot of your girl's gone? And then your boy has it. And he's... <laughs> yeah. That's sure fine. you'd understand. But then yeah, he returns it. He yeah. returns he goes. And it's all sticky. Oh, you guys, here you go. Oh, fucking one, come on. And it's just on his fingers yeah. the whole time, on his trigger finger, and he can't shoot Germans anymore. How mad are you going to be if you go to World War II back in the day? You come back, and the only thing that kept you alive was a picture of a black and white picture of your girl. And you come back, and she's just piping the milkman. I don't hate it. What do I you mean, mean you wouldn't you like it? it? You'll sit down and tell me everything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it looks like you had your own little war last night, huh? <laughs> oh, my God. That's not milk on no. your face. Hey. That's a uh, semen joke. That is what we... Stiff socks. <laughs> I I, it. As long as that person is there to greet me when I get off the ship, that's all that matters. Because, like, you know how all those Hold movies, the, the guy gets off the ship, he returns from war, and they pick you up, and they spin around? Yeah. yeah. If I don't have that, then I'm pissed. You could be cheating, but give me the pickup. Let me tell you something. I'm getting don't make me look like an idiot. Someone's gonna be there. I'll I'll lift my cousin up, my fucking sister. Postmates. Someone. It doesn't even matter. Postmates for a lieutenant. A hundred, dude. Uh, if you have no one to spin around after World War II, that's what I you mean, fight for. Bro. That's what it's worth. That's is the crazy. person that picks you up and spins you around. If I come back from war and it's just my dog, pissed. <laughs> Where's some pussy? I just shot people for two years. I'm dirty. Me a laugh! <laughs> <laughs> this boy's cooked. This boy's all one. This boy needs love. See, that's the I difference. Do, you I got do, Michael when he was love. in a loving relationship. Yeah. And he was this wholesome man. Now he's out here in these streets being like, ah, fucking <laughs> pee on me! No, he's it's actually me. But. <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm. It's it's you not. Know, what is I'm the, not what advocating is the for hair? this. What, what was the point of the blonde hair? Oh. I, here's the thing. If people ask me, and I wish I had a really cool story. I really don't. Did it you was, just feel like it? It was just, uh, I wanted to change it up. I had the same fucking hair for so long, and I just wanted to switch it up. And then I, I did that. it. I, yeah, I, and I, I did that. it on a whim, and then uh, maybe two weeks later, my girlfriend broke up with me. So, you know, I think hmm. I think maybe it had to do with it, but uh, but yeah, there's no, you like, You just needed cra- to change. I needed to change. I didn't want to switch it up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And this is the last time I'm going to die. Really? I'm shooting, yeah, I'm shooting do, something do you think, next week, and I'm done. Do you think blonde is, like, when a guy bleaches his hair, that's a male equivalent of girls getting bangs? It's like a cry for help. Yeah. Yes, it's definitely a cry for help. For I do, sure. I do too. Yeah. I'm yeah. Sorry. No, 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 dude. I mean, no, it is. It for sure. Dude, that's what we're gonna call sure this Michael's cry for help. For sure. No, I, I blazed my hair back in the day, and it's just, it's cool. But then you look at one internet comment, and you're like, ah, never again. Everybody nah. said it looked like my cat peed on my head. Not wrong. Hey. Um, what were the fuck were we talking about? We were talking about World War Two. I wanted to ask you something. Fuck. Hold up. Hold up. How, oh, that's what I want to ask. How long would you wait for someone? So say it was 19, what's World War II? 1942? Oh 40s, yeah. I got it. Oh, that's what, 1942, Day of the Living Infamy. Guys, I know things. So how long would you wait? Some guy, it's beefcake, hot guy. I mean, 19, like the 40s, things were different back then. Yeah. Like it wasn't acceptable to oh, go yeah, around the hoeing. U- it <laughs> wasn't acceptable, but let me tell you something, people did it. Did they? Oh, sure, that's well, where the milkman thing came from. Of course they did. I think it's just human nature. Yeah, the only thing different was yeah. they had a bush. 
That's the only difference. They fucked. <laughs> you think? Sir, Mad Men was was Milkman really laying it down like he that? He laid it down. That's so. What's the equivalent of a Milkman now? Like who's Prob- laying I it mean, down sneakily? I honestly probably like a FedEx or an Amazon package driver. Really? Yeah. Task Rabbit. I don't know. I don't. Ta- no, Task Rabbit actually pretty good because he you're or she has to go in the house and do and some you're shelves. doing manly shit. Oh, dude, there is something about. I'm understanding like a, when a dude's like putting up shelves. Little oh, sweat coming like down. Oh, like a handyman. Yeah. yeah. Handyman. Then he like leaves the fucking belt on as he's fucking yeah. you. Puts a hammer in your ass. They're there like I'm all not doing day great. work. <laughs> what? It's funny if you're a handyman, but you're just not like like me. I would not be like tough or like manly. But, uh, can you hold the screw real quick, dude? I had a task driver come in and ask me to hold the, like hold the like do something, and I was like, sir. <laughs> I'm paying you a lot of money. I don't know what I'm doing. You do it. Don't ask me to hold what, what things. What were they doing? They were putting the the TV mount, mounting the TV. I've held things for my handyman. I mean, did he just come immediately? No. Oh, okay. I've like, I think that he was like doing a chandelier, and I held the chandelier up so he could like finish yeah, the wiring, yeah, 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 something yeah, yeah, like yeah, yeah. that. That's nice. Yeah. Well, it is interesting. Just it's one person. They always show one dude, and they're like, "This is a two-person well, job." Yeah. Like, so they don't have to share the money. Yeah, come on. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. Well, so how long would you wait? Can, are we talking modern day? Let's go like modern now. day. I think it's I think it's easier without any idea of without how any like, idea. when they're coming back. You, you could face someone once a week, but you you don't know when they might come back. No, and you don't know if they're gonna come back. N- I wouldn't wait at all. Wow, <laughs> dude, this <laughs> smell. Yeah, but here, here's the thing. Here's the thing. This is actually the most no no no. This is the most American thing you can do. Because now we're sending soldiers brokenhearted into the war. He's going to fight for this country. Or He's going to be shooting seagulls immediately. He's or he's, he's going to give up on life. Or he's life. not immediately. Like, just Dude, take yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, for but, sure. If I'm going to war and my need those gun, people. No, we don't. No, we don't. We need front of the if line. If I people look at my go, wife, Fuck. if I look at my wife and I go, "Please wait for me," she, immediately she goes, First "No." Of all, if you have to say the words, "Please wait for me," it's over. If it's you been have had kids, over. if you have kids, I think that it send could, them to the If war. you're married with That's kids, a good idea. <laughs> that guy. I think that I think a year, a year or two. After two years, uh, I that's don't know. tough. Yeah, that's really tough. Yeah, two two years of buzz buzzing your clit, too long. Can you visit your man at war? Like you know how they have prison <laughs> visits? <laughs> no, come on. You know they have prison visits. No, Can you visit I don't your man? So, what are you gonna get droned down in <laughs> Afghanistan? <laughs> okay. wow. No, but hear me out. All right, go you ahead. can visit your man in prison. Yes, sir. And you can see him through the glass. You can write letters. They right. don't know how to read anyways. But when they're in there, they have that connection. Yeah. How great would that be? It's like. You know, Lieutenant Blau, your wife is here for a week. Dude, for a week? I'm not... 14 dude, seconds. I don't know. Dude, do you know how it's a, it's quickly It's a dangerous I'll come? area. It's very dangerous. It's not a good idea. I'm not yeah. filled with a lot of bright ideas. But it's not It's not a, It's not not a. a bad idea. It's not a bad idea. But, yeah. I, how do you, well, but how do you get to Iraq? Okay. A plane. Oh. Okay. <laughs> but on Survivor, I used to watch a show a like lot growing up. If you won a certain challenge, they would put you on a ship and then you could like shower and get clean and then you could like your wife would come by. Like imagine they had that. Like, dude, you fucking you you, you, you saved us. Yeah. You brought this or you took down that sniper. But it wouldn't be your wife, it'd be a prostitute. Amsterdam, <laughs> red light district. <laughs> I, I do, mean, I do wonder like if they how many prostitutes they sneak in. In the army? Yeah. Ma'am. You can't have an army all of dudes that are all fucking how many, up. So how many a day is she doing? Is, is that real? They're just walking around just... I mean, I mean the, like... The Vietnam I don't know. I've seen, I've seen TV shows, like yeah. like good TV, like historical TV shows, and there's like a tent, and there's just one prostitute oh, yeah. in there, and there's a nice little line. Or they're like, oh yeah, grandma yeah. was a nurse in the war. <laughs> what what wounds? Do? Yeah. <laughs> just putting Ben Gay in your own cooter after 19 guys... <laughs> I don't know. Like, how many? I don't know. I didn't know this was going on. Is that why people join the military? I don't fucking know. Is I that what people are you doing? <laughs> are you kidding me? You need guns, camo, a fresh and ass free fan, and a hose? I'm Respectfully? In. I'm in. I just want the gun. <laughs> well, here's the thing. You live in America. You can get one. I shouldn't have one. No. A blonde no. guy with a gun? No. Jesus Over. Christ. Blonde guy with a gun is not okay. Ah. I w- yeah. First Wells Fargo employee that gives me any pushback. <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> Wells Fargo, did you give pushback if somebody had an Auntie Anne's? <laughs> that dude, Auntie Anne's is so good. Wow. Um, <sighs> Dave, do you have any questions that they wrote in? And then we'll. Yeah, we do. Um, we have a 
we have a couple questions today. We just have a couple of things, uh, follow-up things to get through real Good. quick. Um, I wanted to go back to the hot wifing really quick because Michael, I think that this is actually, I don't know if you've heard this term, what? but I do think this hot describes wifing? you. Yeah, Mia was talking about this. So it's okay. kind of related to being a cuck, but it's yes. more like um, a, a man actively encouraging his partner to sleep with other men and come talk about it. And part of the appeal versus like being a cuck where you want to be humiliated right. is like, look at how hot my wife is. Look how hot my girlfriend is. Look oh. at all the sex she gets to have. Oh. She comes and talks to me about it. So it's more like an empowered cuck. So does that fit with you more? This does fit with me, but I don't want to see it though. No, yeah. no, no, you don't no, have not, to. You're just you're telling. Not. You're just telling so your stories. What is this called? You're the guy around a campfire. Hot wife. My wife hot sucks. Wife. Ah. You like hot wives? <laughs> Back in the day. There's lots of porn out there for she you. She's the best. Scally wife. Fucking some more, some more and fucking tell me how she's get piped yeah. down. Yeah. Uh, you said there's a lot of porn. It's called Hot Wife? Hot Wife, yeah. And Naughty it, America. I used to shoot for Naughty America and they had like a whole series. God, Naughty America. Just they the were words like kind of Naughty of America people, makes right? me hard. Milf, Naughty, Naughty America was good. They always did like the mom stuff? Milf. Maybe. Uh, no, they, they, they definitely did MILF stuff. Because they've been around for a while, yeah? Yeah. I remember I used to, this is so funny, I used to print out photos from that website when I was in like ninth grade and I'd hide them in a paintball magazine. And I remember that logo, Naughty America on the bottom. John Michaels. Yeah, Naughty, Naughty America, yeah. I can remember the font. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Fuck. God. You probably saw it this morning. A hundred percent, dude. <laughs> Um, I mean, so, it's not it's so what not is it, okay. A power cuck? That sounds like something you get at Sweet Green. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, it's like a. I think it would be, feel good for you. It's, it's, try it out. Give us an update. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> right. Funny. <laughs> good bowl. <laughs> Fucking funny, Dog dude. Spring mix Extra in tofu. It. Yes. I'm in. God. Any other follow-ups? Yeah, we have Fuck. one more. Um, Good. The, there was a survey done in 1948 by Kinsey. And, uh, 1948? And they that found wasn't that even a real survey? In the late what did they record <laughs> it on? A stick? Uh, so in the early, late 1940s, early 1950s, approximately 33% of men and 26% of women in an American sample were adulterous. What does that mean? Dude, they, they, were, cheating. they were cheating. cheating. Oh. Can you... Can, and now can you look Damn. up current? But it because it's so much easier. There's no paper trail. There's no phones. There's no like turn your location I know, but, on. Where were that, you? The factory. Oh, okay. But well, that's also, that's also funny. 1933. I feel, like I feel like yeah, there must have been a lot more than that. There's no. Because they had to really keep there's that There's no hush paper hush, trail. Right? Yeah. Dude, you know how easy it would be to leave a family in 1933 like this. Goodbye. It's over. <laughs> It's over. Except the car doesn't have like power steering. You're like goodbye. <laughs> yeah, never. Ma, she. That's what I would do well, if I if I came in 1933. Ma, she. You can still do that. I can. Just wear a top hat. I'm sad. What um? <laughs> what's, uh, it what's looks like around 44 percent <laughs> reported now. 44. Here's lies. Lies. Yeah, yeah, can yeah, I yeah, say yeah. this though too? In 1933, Holy, it was that really it was really 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 frowned upon to cheat. Of so they were lying. Right. So it's probably way higher. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. that's what I said. Um, yeah, too. I just still like for some reason this seems like higher than I expected for people reporting even back then. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, that's pretty high. Dude, I expected it to be higher for men and lower for women because this thing thirty six percent of men. I feel like ninety five percent of men were cheating on their wives in the nineteen forties. Yeah, well, yeah. they didn't even call it cheating if they were like fuck their secretary. That's just work. Yeah, that's not crazy. Yeah, yeah. God damn, Dude, secretaries get piped down I think in I my head. I don't know if it really happens. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. I'm sure it did. <laughs> Huh? I'm sure it did. They do, man. I used to well, have the, Of course. Well, yeah, but isn't that funny? Whatever, you, think about, you think about your... Because uh, yeah, that's who they're like spending Gosh, time with all the time. And then it's like the, they look up to him like, oh, like he's more... That's what I'm saying. I had an assistant whatever ago, so long ago, whatever. <laughs> and and I, when I first met, I was like, hey, how are you? It's nice to... And then, you know, you work a little bit together. And it's not like she was in my house all the time, but when she was... You spend, yeah, you spend time with each other and you like start to develop. Yeah. Yeah. Like, and then she's like, ha ha ha. Feelings. And then she yeah, and my then jokes. It's also, it's also normal, especially for men. Fuck like, yeah. you're attracted to, I'm assuming, a lot of things. Yeah. I'd I'm a, fuck a plant. Yeah. <laughs> yeah 100%. <laughs> I know. Yeah. I'd fuck a deflated balloon. Who gives a shit? Yeah. That's why I gotta get these fake ones, you know, turn around to. But I do think that you get work, uh, beer goggles and work, but like the work lens is like, yeah. you're there, you meet everybody, like, hey, how are you doing? And then like week three, you're like, what the fuck? Yeah, dude. I, you always had as much ass. Dude, it and might. you're like, HR now. And you're like, all right, fine. And HR got ass. You're like, everybody got ass. God damn. Everyone got tits. Everyone got aerial. Right. But it's a product of your environment. Oh, dude, you settle I, in. I hooked up with this bartender one time that worked at my work that in work, she was like a fucking nine. And then outside of work, average. 
Mm. Average. I don't. It's but, but she was it, the most attractive person there. She wasn't. Yeah. She actually. I think that makes a big difference. Of course. Yeah. Like the hot. You go to a club and and the hottest girl at the club. You're gonna have your eyes on her the whole night, even if she's a five. Because it, that's what's your Fetch. in your environment. Yeah. That's yes. what's your. That's why I go to just nothing but places where ugly people go to. So you're like the insane plowing Kasi. Whoa, that wasn't even a sentence. What? ICP concert? Yeah, I was gonna say that. But so I you're the hot guy. Up. Yeah. No. Uh, no, I was just the logic track. Yeah, yeah. I'm just saying that's where I go to places where generally. Do you guys hit on people like just out and about? Randomly I don't know how to do it. Bars? I can't. Do I it. get shy. I'm I feel like I get it's, so it's nervous. Even even as like a like a woman, if someone comes up to me, I'm just so. If somebody comes up to me it, in general. You can't really say anything. Yeah. You cannot say anything that will pique my interest. It's like, what do you? Why are you bothering me? Well, this is actually. A I would question. have to feel like an eye contact once or twice and be like, okay, there feels like there could be a thing here. Then yeah, shoot you'd the have shot. to see the woman blind, staring like, at the you. Cold thing like in the movies, crazy. is this seat taken? Like what? First of all, it, in, or like, in 2023, hi, this John, bitch is are always you a taken. model. Yeah. <laughs> it, 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 I just the the intros are always what. It's, what? What is a? I don't what know has, how you can do it. What has worked for you? If a guy like comes up to you and talks to you at a bar, is there anything that's like worked well, how, for how you in the past? How did you meet the last relation, guys in last relationships? I'm uh, at work on stream. Every oh. every relationship I've known them from work. So it's never worked uh, just off camera. But I, I really? like that angle oh, because yeah. it's like you get to know them and then you slowly kind of like fall for them instead of like this like, what's up? I'm in your face. We're doing this now. You're hot. And you're like, there's so much I want. But this is kind of like, oh, this guy. Oh, that's funny. Oh, there's a... a yeah, the exactly. I, I like people who are in social media in front of the camera because it gives you like a little bit of an you idea know. if you're going to like them or not. Yeah. At least a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Whereas some random person that walks up, I think no there's, there's so many attractive men. Like that means nothing to me. Yes, you guys are both both very attractive. But Let's that means go, dude. that means nothing to me. <laughs> like without Obviously a personality oh, and oh, okay. chemistry. Oh, okay. So yeah. it's so like count him out. Yeah, there's Time nothing out. there's nothing you can do without like having any true. sort of prior knowledge. That, at least that's how well, I Well that's am. like the first thing if somebody goes I this I want to hook you up with this one person and you're like, all right, cool. What is their Instagram? And then you explore yes. the person out. Yes. Like it's, it's a, and there's you so many layers. And you're to like, it. like, yeah, maybe or you're like no. You ex Sorry, well, you know what? And, and yeah, maybe dude, this is the right comparison. Instagram, if I go on a girl's Instagram and show them any pictures of any friends, I'm out. Or well, the really? tag photos are blocked. What's going on? Well, let me know if this you is accurate. I mean? And I'm not trying no, to. No, I don't. Like, what? if what I'm saying is like, in, in, unless you're actually like a social media uh, personality. Mm -hmm. uh, but if I go on your Instagram, you have like, if if you're not a, if you're like a lawyer oh. or whatever, and Just then no. there's no pictures of friends. It's a little weird, and if the comments on like pictures, you know, you post a picture, and you're like, all right, I'm, I am attempting to get comments and likes. If they do one of those pictures and there's only like three comments, then I'm like, you don't have a lot of like support around you. And so that, there's a lot yeah. of those. Those two things are pretty big red flags to me. Do you feel like looking yeah, yeah, yeah. up somebody's Instagram when somebody gives you a name of somebody is like essentially when you go to a restaurant and the menu doesn't have photos and you go to Yelp to look at it? Yeah, it's kind of like a business card. Yeah, like, I, I like I. Somebody, I need to look at the Instagram. I need yeah. to be like, what's going on here? Same. How do I'm they like, write? Let me, let me look them Are up. Are their captions yeah. funny? Are they riffing a little bit? Or is it just playing like, life lately? <laughs> All right. Espresso martini. Great. I love you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Yeah. But but I go immediately A to B. I got to, I, I, I want the full 360, especially if there is video, because video says so much about video's like. Oh, video is a big Because things I can see are what fun face tuned. You don't what actually, is happening? You don't I don't actually know. know. What I, is happening well, in this town? You should have seen them in What video. is happening in this town? So many people don't look like they, they look. And, and sure, I have Dude. my angles. I, I'm probably a little of red course. right now. I'm sweating. My side angle's but not good. But you still good. look like you. Nigel Thornberry, yes. But I want people to be like, this is still the same guy. I've been on a few dates and I go, what? No. You're, this is not no. Yeah. But, I, but I don't understand but what the game is. What's the game? Because if you face tune and you come in life, you can't face tune in life. This is an AI. I don't understand. So, that, so you think I? You think my vision's bad? Like it's this. It's the. I think a lot of it. They're they're getting enough, like just enough validation online for them to feel better about themselves. Like right. they're looking for that validation and do they're you, getting it there. Do you think that they perceive themselves as how they look in the face? You're like, this is me. This is clearly me. This in is ways, my best version. In yeah. ways, yeah, yeah, best Dude, version. Dude, I had I had a lady uh, a couple nights ago literally send me like a oh, right. like a hot video, but it was filtered. 
So when there when there be certain movements, oh, the tongue, the skin, well, not falls off, but like I, I guess so. Yeah. But it, like, it like stops skin, for a second, yeah. Like skin, like the skin would turn. Yeah, and yeah. I'm like, but I get that. I mean, like the, if you're sending a hot photo at like three in the morning, or like, video, I look terrible. It was, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, was a, it was a video, so it was yeah. like such a hot video. But it was, but when they're moving, it, yeah, you could such see a hot the, video. Fuck. Did but the, did that kind of like distract you a bit? A little bit, but I was mm -hmm. rock hard so yeah. for like a half a second. See, see, that's like that. That thankfully, that's like blurring the skin, which is not that big of yeah, a yeah, deal. Yeah, yeah. Soften it up a little yeah, bit. Whereas, yeah, whereas like there's yeah, yeah. so many filters and Snapchat filters, they change their actual yes. face. They I mean, there's some. It's called like the one on TikTok is like bold something and you look at it you go this is a hot version of me i think everyone looks terrible with that filter but but, but i think people in general look worse with filters that's my opinion of course well you it's can like, also why like, are tell. you using a filter yeah, yeah, yeah. like why do you think N you have that's to use i one? immediately go no if i see too strong of a filter because i go what type of person is this where you're like i just want to be somebody who's comfortable in their own what however uh, they look their own skin yeah, yeah. but we're so used to filters you can tell immediately if somebody's using a filter or not yeah. So in my head, I'm like, ugh, like you're such a nice lady. Why you don't have to do this? But it's still weird because we know also, that it's face tuned, but we, sh but there's, st it's like. But you also want to look good, so it's like this. Right. Middle, it's like what's the middle? Is ground? this all men? Because I'm assuming you two are able to get some like higher, like women. Uh, that's my opinion. All women are higher for him. Then, He's five then, nine. Then a lot of other Sorry. men. So are you I guys just it. more picky about it? I missed and it. And other men are just. What? I'm sorry. I missed his his joke. And I fucking I said all it. women are higher than him because you're five nine. Yeah, it would have been better in the moment. No, I'm I sorry. Feel bad. No, 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 don't feel bad. No, 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 Five, dude. Even five, dude, five, five, and we put on heels and we're looking at each other in the eyes. It's fucking, it's chaos. So wait, what uh, I'm saying? sorry. Well, the question was, uh, one more time. I don't know either. You said, <laughs> you said, <laughs> well, you said it. You guys probably get like very beautiful women, but are all men that picky about women that use filters and stuff? Or yeah, do you think or do they is? see it and they're like, she's fucking hot. Like, I, I'm I do, get I in do there. think they try to trick themselves, and I, I do too. I do too, right? Oh, it's yeah. like I got some you, angles where I'm like, holy fucking jawline. What am I, Matt Rife? What's going on here? But like, I know my jawline, certain angles, good. Front on, what is this? But <laughs> I feel, you just want to, you want to look good, but there's, a, you blur that line where you're like, oh, we look good. Oh, add a little more here, a little more there, a little more. Then it's just, it's it's so far away from the reality. Yeah. I, but to, but to, an, our best to work, answer but. your question, like I, I do think that most guys do care, but guys, if they are, uh, horny will get past most things. Yeah, I'm also Do looking for love. Do you prefer to so see want... like flaws? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Dude, I like love a girl who's like photos, just like her it with like frizzy hair and like in so pajamas, hot. being like with like so sunglasses on, be like me, mood, hungover, whatever. Because then I'm like, yeah. oh, there's personality. There, yeah. we're being vulnerable. We're showing all sides. Yeah. When I see too much face tune and too many filters, I go like. I'm scared that you're not comfortable in your own yeah. skin. Good Im imperfections yeah. are hot. Yeah. yeah. You're full. It's hot. human. It's it's like more it's like hot. natural. Like I, I think yeah. it pulls out that natural yeah. Yeah. like It's not even about the, the filter the looks. It's just maybe like the person behind that might not be comfortable. Yeah. It gives which you I get. An idea. I get it. But here's the thing. I'm looking for love. So I want somebody who has all angles where they're like, here's the imperfections inside of me. Here's this. Here's that. It's just when I see too much filter, I, I immediately go, that's, I don't know if that's a, like a wife for me personally. And I could be yeah, wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I usually yeah. am. I'm a man. But that's your your first impression. Correct. And it, it's a bad first impression. But that's why I don't even like dating yeah. apps because it's just like, it's so like, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. It's you're just not training your brain to give anybody more than a half second of evaluation. Yeah. Which is crazy to be like, you as a human, as a whole human being, no. What? I think it's so funny when I think about how many people swipe no on me. I think it's so goddamn Dude, funny. You look imagine. at a picture of me and you, and some girl in fucking Temecula some. is like, no. It's it's yeah. so funny to me. Of course. Just look at something that I I like I like curated. Yeah. I was like People are gonna like me, and then they just <laughs> sit in their fucking pajamas. It takes half a second. Yeah, they go. Yeah, Nick. it's so funny to me. But there's people that look at my or your photo and go. Whoa. Yeah, and yeah. Then they go going. immediately disgusting. But I saw a quote and I always forget it. It's like you can be the juiciest. I always forget it. And <laughs> shut up. <laughs> you, you could be the juiciest peach in the world, but some people don't like peaches, and that's yeah, fine. Yeah. If I you agree. don't like 
meat, then that's not your taste. It's a hard or pill to swallow because I think we all want to be liked and accepted, course, but that is the reality of the situation. I will say though, if you're all, if everyone likes you and everyone accepts you, you have Something's a wrong with you. You're yeah, fake. you have a problem. Yeah, yeah. You're just trying to please everyone except yes. yourself. Uh, we have some submissions today. This first one's actually not a question. Uh, this comes from Amara and she said, uh, I wanted to share a new phrase I came up with. I was giving my boyfriend head last night and I woke up with a sore throat. So I came up with the phrase deep throat, sore throat. Huh. Cool. I think. I mean, I think you have herpes, but yeah. <laughs> no, I think that there has to be a better. It's a, it's a long phrase. Yeah, yeah. So she calls it DTST. That's where. You, oh, there I like you go. that. Yeah, I like DTSD. that. Dude, so that guy must feel so good. It sounds so like good. an STD. It's close. Yeah. <laughs> you start putting too many random letters next to each other. Is that that's never happened to me? So is is that real? Like, can you take a cock so big that it makes your throat sore? It doesn't even have to be. Big. I think they're unrelated. Hell it just yeah. has to be hard. Oh, because it's just it's the hottest thing you said yeah. all the whole fucking podcast. <laughs> I mean, cut oh, it's, that. It's that's my ringtone. <laughs> Wait, so it's just, it just it's just poking at the back of your. Yeah, it's hitting it, and yeah, you, he just has to be really hard and turned on. But you know, doctors do like popsicle sticks. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so is that like pretty common then? Like a sore throat from head? Yeah. Wow. Well, well it's, it's if you're getting face fucked. Okay. Face fucking so hot. It's like getting Dude, it's getting back there. I hooked up with an adult films lady and we oh, started. Oh, we, I told you this already. Oh. And we started. We started in the. I said already. I said this already. We start, but I didn't tell you. We started in, in a dishwasher. Was, hilarious. No, we started when she was on her back on the bed and her head was over the edge of the bed, and I was face fucking backwards like the. You know, are you catching this visual yet? I'm trying. She's, okay, I'm she's, sorry. She's like doing the reverse rainbow. So, she, so bed, right? Yeah, so no, bed. I, I get it. And her she, head is her hanging head, off the bed. Like this. Uh, and, bed then I'm, and then I'm standing. Oh, oh. Yes. Started okay. there. Yeah. Hey. Whoa. Fuck. Started there. Started. Started was crazy. First, that's wow. first base. Crazy. Wow. That's like starting a meal with lamb chops. <laughs> crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. It's like, yeah. already here. It's like wake it up and just doing heroin. <laughs> okay, Damn. That's crazy. Was, did you instigate the position? No, she did. But, I know. But I think she saw like a guy like that. I was like, I'm going to fucking blow your mind. That's what the yeah. girl that I hooked up with told me. She's like, I want to show you what I can do. I was like, police. Yeah. Put it in sport. Let me you just know? stretch first. <laughs> but, <laughs> but I think that that angle was like, she wanted to be like, yeah. let me blow your mind. She did. Because I, I feel you had never had that before. Or no, started with I, that I before. had it before. It didn't start there. I usually yeah. start yeah. with, I don't know, kissing. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, I'm Michael. <laughs> um, we have a Secret Sock Anonymous submission today. Yes, yeah, so uh, Submission, good. They wanted to say, I got dumped by my asshole boyfriend, turned around, and I banged the coach of his favorite NFL team. Wow. Who is this, my ex girlfriend? Damn. <laughs> Damn. That's that good, good for good. her. Dude, oh, that's good. good. For her, dude. Yeah. That's badass, actually. QB would be better. It's like in your <laughs> face. A coach will fuck anything. <laughs> I don't, no, no, that's not true. I, dude, I kind of like, like the coach because it's like fucking daddy. Because yeah. daddy tells oh, us what he's to do. Of the team? Yeah, because the quarterback goes, Oh, daddy, what play are we going to call? The daddy goes, <laughs> Fucking call fucking X2899. Quarterback don't make a fucking call. Daddy does. So that, so that fucking, she, fu we can actually find out who it was, though. Because there's not a lot of single coaches. I think there's That's like two. Crazy, yeah. I think the Florida Panthers coach, it doesn't matter. There's some coach that's like 32 and hot as shit. She also doesn't say there's because there's this is such a dumb question. There's the head coach, but there's other coaches too, right? Correct. She, oh, she was the head coach. Yeah. If, she, if she fucked a lineman she coach, I'm head coach. Head. Oh, I'll oh, shoot everybody. <laughs> no, oh good. no, I didn't miss that. Was the head coach? She was the head coach because she gave head to the guy. Coach. Coach. <laughs> we'll work on it. Okay, my bad. <laughs> I think that's awesome. That is awesome. That is cool. I, I got, I got no. I got no problem. Deserve feel better. You should also it. just fuck his dad just to really <laughs> land it, just to stick it, or delete his fantasy team. I don't know. Yeah, I love all this. Or burn his fucking apartment down. Yeah, why not? Arson's in. Arson's in. Would you guys? I have a question. Please, please. Would you still be friends with somebody that you genuinely cared about? Another guy, if he fucked your ex girlfriend. Here's the thing. I was that guy once, and that guy wanted to beat my ass. For about four months, I hid from him. <laughs> uh, and now we're boys again. Did you think that it would be cool while you were doing it? Or no, were you kind of just like, fuck him, not going to tell the thing. him? I was, I think that she knew that me and him were friends. And she's like, I want to get back at him. 
he's an easy target, me. I was like, whoa, well, you're hitting on me? Well, she probably always wanted to fuck you, too. Oh, interesting. Like, yeah, that's that's usually how but it works. But yeah, it was just like at a party on a futon, and boy, did I nut quick. <laughs> did you lie down the futon, or did you leave I it up? I didn't have time for that. Yeah, who cares? <laughs> <laughs> but I... So you're saying like if he slept with my ex, would I be friends with him? Yeah. Oh man. No. No. I, no. That would I would never me. have sex with his ex. Not in a bad way. Come on, mate. Don't make this weird. I wouldn't. For you. Not because not uh, yeah, because she's yeah. not beautiful. <laughs> How do you word this? How do you words up being mean? This is it's worse impossible. than you he fucking He said a her. nice thing. <laughs> this is worse than you beat but it I, up. But how do you word this in a nice way? Yeah. You say I would never respectfully do that. It's a very easy to word. <laughs> All right, well, yeah, that's what, what, okay, right. what, your answer, then your answer. Well, it, okay. I'll give a so scenario that's here. happening in my, well, no, like, like <clears throat> okay, yeah. I hook up with your ex. Simple as that. Yeah, no, I'm out. Unless, unless you sat me down and really walked me through it and was like, I, I know this is weird, but Listen, I have a lot bro, of feelings, blah, blah, blah. Up, dude. Yeah, no, we no. Had a good chemistry. <laughs> if you like told me that you like really, like you really liked her, genuinely cared. then, then yeah, of course. I want her to be happy. I want you to be happy. Of course. I, wow. That'll be fine. But, very... but if you just like, if you just got hammered one night and then <laughs> and just hit and then told me, I would be fucking furious. Of course. Yeah, yeah. What about you? I wouldn't care. I wouldn't care. Nice. I, I've had, I have like a, I have a friend who's had, who's slept with my ex and I genuinely did not care at all. Was it a time difference? It was like, oh, this was an ex from five years ago? Well, it was while we were care? together in an open relationship. Oh, wow. <laughs> and then I became good friends with her. After. Oh, interesting. Yeah. I'm friends. Well, this is a different scenario. Like I have, I have an ex, and now I'm friends. I'm always friends with my ex, but now I'm friends with her current boyfriend. Mm. So you know, we all have had sex with the lady, but we're all like Isn't friends. That cool. That's you like go to it's Cheesecake different. Factory. How do you guys know each other? Cynthia. <laughs> her name's not Cynthia. No, it's not. Um, that's I. Okay, that's 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 uh that's bit that's big. I don't think I'd ever care. Honestly, I don't. I don't know why, but and I feel like an ex is an ex, and and I mm. I fully understand why people do, but like just personally, like I don't ever plan to get with that person again. Usually, I don't have any sort of relationship. It's like go off, once like do what you got to do. Once it's done, it's done. Yeah, oh, that makes sense. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. But don't you feel like the person, if the person is your true friend, that have some type of like res, like responsibility to like let you know that's their like their impulse to yeah, do like it? Yeah, like a code, or? definitely. Yeah, if, they're yeah, a yeah. if they're a true friend. Right. right I've right. done that to somebody years <clears throat> ago, um, but I, I knew instantly what after I did it, I was like, I'm not their friend. <laughs> Funny. Right. I mean, that's ultimately what boils it down to. Yeah, that post that we got, you're like, I didn't even need them. I was like, I yeah, I them. like them, but I am not their friend. <laughs> well, you're, also, you're sampling the waters. Like, who do I like more, Tyler or his ex? Yeah, you know? I was like, I, then, I like the guy more. Yeah. <laughs> like, right, if anything, right. that brings you the most clarity of who you liked more in that relationship. Yeah. It's not a bad thing. You're just learning. I don't think anything is bad in life. You're just learning. You can't well, fuck think, up. You're just I learning. Word. I, I, well, I think things are bad, but I of think course. that it's human. Yeah. <laughs> it, it generally it's human nature. Generally I didn't, speaking, we're all going to do bad yeah, things. Yeah, yeah. I didn't mean to murder him. I was learning. <laughs> <laughs> generally, uh, right. The, to a ceiling of some sort. But, like, you know, if you do end up in a situation where you hook up with somebody's ex, you're not, it's not the best choice, but you go, I fucked up. I learned that I didn't like that. I'm not going to do that again. Yeah. And he probably won't ever talk to me again. And yeah. there's a red dot on my forehead. Please don't shoot me, Tyler. <laughs> Bang. <laughs> Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I think that's a podcast. Is that a podcast? That's a podcast. <clears throat> Dude, Mia yeah. Malkova, thank you, Anything thank you for coming. Anything you'd like to thank promote, you plug me. your website, where places can find? OnlyFans. And hey. what's the at? OnlyFans.com slash Mia Malkova. Boom. Do you still have a deal with Fleshlight? I do. Go buy yeah. her Fleshlight. <laughs> Love it. Promo um, code. <clears throat> uh. Guys. Thank you so much. Mia, thank you so much for coming. We love you. you. Round two is great. And uh, that is it. Guys, thank you so much. We are out. We love you. And good morrow, good night. Bye.